Uh, so here's the real real. Uh, I just woke up. I'm at a pain level of about six, so not too bad. Um, and I have been watching my granddaughter every day uh, from most, for most of the day because my youngest is having a new job this week and I'm very proud of her. She's being such an awesome mom boss. And we've got a lot of family drama going on right now um, and I can't talk about it, but so that's a, a added level of stress and so pain stress and I'm so tired like I'm, I'm waking up it's uh, about 7 a.m. I've had about five hours of sleep which um, for those of us who are chronic illness warriors when you have about five hours of sleep that equals about two for us it's kind of like you're a battery that can't be charged right if that makes any sense anyway so given all that we get to watch a little today um, so I'm gonna give you some behind-the-scenes look at how that goes on a day three of me being in a lot of pain and super tired yeah so for those of you who have been um, messaging me wanting to see a little bit more of all that you're gonna get it today um, and you might see some funny stuff you might see some wild stuff I don't even know so yeah here we go and did I mention how exhausted I am? Like, mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually. Like, on every level, I am so drained. Like, I can't even tell you. <laughs> Who else has been there? Probably everybody, right? So, we're going to see how this goes when you are, um, you have nothing to give. You have nothing to give. But yet, you have to engage with a child, you have to pick, stand up and down. Uh, she loves to crawl and get in my lap and play with me and my belly and my abdomen is, you know, not the best area for all that. So this is day three of dealing with that. <laughs> but it's weird, like when you're really sick, um, somehow you get like extra energy and extra like, I don't even know, it's like you get uh, energy and mental wherewithal to handle things that you physically when you first wake up feel like there's no way I can do this today there's no way um, but yeah you do it somehow you do it any of the chronic illness moms out there comment below you know you know so yeah I'm basically um, gonna it's just like an experiment in what I can handle and how I can get through the day <laughs> when I hurt so much and I'm so tired but it's cool it's cool we got this we got this are you shook by my makeup look as rich Lux would say <laughs> good because this is all you're getting today it's a no makeup day hairs up and a little bun kind of thingy got some chapstick on got all clean just got out the shower made myself do that because lord um <laughs> uh, i got some chapstick on got my moisturizer on and all the essentials and we're gonna do this um we usually start out my granddaughter and i with nursery rhyme songs in the morning and um she loves waffles so i think that's what we're gonna do uh yesterday i had to do laundry dishes uh cook dinner for the family uh, take out the trash and uh, watch and entertain my little so got that accomplished um, and today I've got some more trash duties I've got to dust I've got a bunch of stuff to do and um, today we're um, focusing on our left and right uh, Raylo is working on that right now and she's doing so well and so we really want to reinforce that today so work on left and right and Grammy is trying to get stuff done around the house while I'm running on empty. But we got this, right? We got this, we got this. Love you guys. So we also like to watch what Raylo calls a play Paw Patrol, which are people demonstrating different Paw Patrol toys and other various children favorites on YouTube. So, here we go. I'm going to show you our routine. Breakfast, either songs, some kind of learning show of some sort, 
or the play Paw Patrol. You can see all of them down there. So this is super cool. I like watching process videos on YouTube, so it's really funny that my granddaughter likes watching sort of process videos as well. <laughs> Just gotta say. And here she is. Raylo! Hi! <laughs> when you can take bingo, only so many times. B-I-N-G-O. B-I-N-G-O. Just step outside, take a break. Take a breath. She's gotten worn out. Uh, Mary Poppins is on. She's really into musicals lately. And this is the result. <laughs> Today, uh, my granddaughter actually spent the night with another family member last night, and she's hanging out with them for a while this morning, which is really great for me. I was able to rest a little bit longer this morning, thank goodness. And uh, she's got a ton of laundry that needs to be done for um, her to be clothed this week. So I'm going to be working on that today and some other tasks. And yeah, we're just going at it full steam. Full steam ahead. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Hope everybody's doing well. I'm going to give you some more footage of my cute little granddaughter here later. On mornings or days where I am not feeling really myself and I'm still feeling super drained on every level um I like this combination it's really really good some CBD water and NeuroBliss mixed together really does help you feel better um, helps ease some pain the CBD of course always helps ease pain helps anxiety depression things like that and NeuroBliss has some interesting ingredients that are supposed to help you feel better and calmer i'm sorry more calm see the chamomile and all that good stuff in there so yep yeah, this is going to be part of my drinks today and i'm also going to be naughty and have a energy drink what <laughs> hopefully that tip helps I don't know if you can see, but today we also have some rain slash sleet slash snow going on here in Tennessee. Yay, climate change. But loving being out here in one of my little happy spots. One of my happy places. What's the weather like in your area? Comment down below. Today, my little discovered DC superhero girls on Netflix. Thank God. She loves it. Thank God. <laughs> Granny is a DC fan, so yay. So this is day, I don't even know what at this point. It's been a few days of high pain, a little sleep, and watching littles. So I am exhausted. Hey. But it's fun. I love you, Raylo. I love you, Raylo. <laughs> Today, one of our activities, my granddaughter and I, will be to work on this awesome fairy garden that she got as a gift from her auntie. And it's called My Fairy Garden Tree Hollow. And it's really cool, and it comes with some really cool accessories, looks like. It comes with all the stuff you need to grow the plants. And it comes with fairies. And some tools. And let's check the back out. Yeah. Granny's finger was in the way most of the time. Look at the back. Show everybody. Yeah, look at all that cool stuff. And there's a bridge. Yeah, and there's the fairy. And look, there's a little place for the fairies to sit. So, check it out, guys. We're going to make this here in just one minute. What do you think, Raylo? 
Perfect. Perfect. All right, so here we go. This is the cool box. Let's open it up and see what's inside. And always, littles, make sure you have a big person with you if you're going to open something like this, right? I love you. I love you more. Did you not know I can rock the chair like this? I didn't know that. <laughs> Look at there's the book that tells us what to do. Let's see what else is in here. There's looks like the bottom. Oh, I see some dirt in here for us. Whoa. Look at all this cool stuff. Hey, you're the mom. <laughs> yeah. Here, throw it over here. Here we go. Here we go. What is this part look like? I don't know. It's, here, sit over here. Look, it looks like the middle. It does look like the middle. <laughs> I can't wait to get started to build it. Same. All right, so this looks like the house. Okay. That looks like the top. Yeah, this looks like the bottom. Here's all our seeds. I wonder what kind of seeds are in here. Let's see, it says we have common botanical names are ryegrass, mustard seeds, and pea seeds. Pretty cool. Here, have a seat, baby. Okay. I love you. So let's look at the accessories that are in here. I can't believe here's some dirt. I know, that's so cool. Huh? That's the dirt we need, right? That's right. That's what the seeds go in. We I got this wait cool thing. This Don't know what this little wire thing is, but we'll figure it out. Look, here's where we can put some water to water our plants with. This looks like part of the bridge. That would be like. Look, that's what you can dig with. Here. Like this. Yeah, once we open it up. <laughs> Look, that's what the birds, that's the bird feeder. That's what they drink out of. Oh, what is this? That's a scoop for you. Look, yeah. here's another tool. What is that? I think that's called a spade. Oh, look at that. What is that? That's a tool for you. Look, here's another chair. Look, you got a pink chair and a yellow chair. And a, and a little tiny one of these in it. <laughs> That's funny. So funny. And here's your fairy. Oh, wow, look. And she comes with a little tiny rabbit. <laughs> Let's get started to build it. Yeah, let's get started. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. This, I don't know what that is. That's a bridge. So we put these on. These are the sides of the bridge. So we'll do those first. Okay, that side. Looks like it goes like this. There's the bridge. There's look. the bridge. So look, there's the picture. We can do like the picture, see? And I think we hook it up over here. Yes. Ooh, it's coming together. There's a little rabbit. <laughs> okay, so it looks like it's showing on the picture right here that the doors go to the front. <clears throat> hmm. I got a bunny with my legs. You did. <laughs> what color is this, Raylo? Uh, 
purple, and pink, and yellow. And yellow. Good job. You're so smart. I love you. I love you. I love, I love, you, love you. Love you. Love you. Where, 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 where's the... Oh, I want to have a shiny. Okay. And the water. And the watering can? <laughs> yeah. That is my favorite. <laughs> Okay, so now is the fun part where we get to put the dirt in here. They go in these little spots right here. Let me make sure. Let's look at the book and make sure. Oh, I see. This was supposed to go in here. The rut room. What was that? I don't know. Was it true? No. I can't wait to get start, started with this. How do we open this? That's a good question. I think I'll cut it. Okay, but how? With my scissors. Okay, so I don't want it to get on my hands, so I'll do it over there. <laughs> you got it. Or by your side. We're on your side. Okay. I love you. I love you. Okay, so I can't figure out where that goes yet. So let's. This goes on the front. It says. Where's the? Oh yeah, right here. So this goes on the front, like the little light for the fairies when they come home. Okay. Now what do we do next? Now it says we put the dirt in. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> Are you going to help me? Sure. But how do I help? <laughs> I'll show you. I completely work it. <laughs> Started on the fair garden to play with it. I know we've been waiting since how long? Twelve. Since Christmas. Okay. So I'm gonna pour it in, and why don't you get your little tool and make sure everything is smooth for Granny? You wanna do that? Yeah. That one, or maybe one of these. And pour it it's in. not smooth. Pour it in. It's not smooth. Good. Pour it in. Good job. Oh, good job. And parents, it looks like there's um, plenty of dirt here in this kit, which is nice. You're not going to have to dig into your own dirt outside or anything like that. And we're doing it on this plasticky table, so it'll be easy to wipe off when we're all done. Are you good with your smoothing? Did you get it all done? Here, let's see. Oh, that's so good. Can I help? Sure. Pat, pat, pat. Pat, pat, pat. Let me do it by myself. Okay. Wow, that's so good. Here, come over here. Now it's time for seeds. Here's our seed packet again. We're going to put in there. Here's our seeds. They're right here. Why? And remember, they're going to start out tiny and we won't be able to see them. And soon they'll look like the picture, all grown like that. Oh, and then what are we going to do with the fairy and bunny? Uh, that's for you to decide. You get to pick where they go. Now, this is your part. You get to sprinkle the seeds in there. Ooh, good job. Can you put some here too? Good. And look, there's a few left. Look, Granny, put some over here. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. On this side? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just that we have seeds on all sides. You do what I'm going to do next. I, oh, you did. You had, a, you had the right idea. We get these and we kind of push them down in the dirt. Make sure they get covered up like a blanket. Because they're little baby, little baby plants and they need a blanket. Okay, put that one in there. You did so good. You got to do that. Uh huh. Good job. Oh, good. So let's put some more dirt over there on them. Cover them up like a blanket. 
Is mine covered up like a bay? Yeah, like. you did so good. Now we get to water them. Let's put some water in here. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. So we filled up our watering can. Now it's time to water our seeds. We lay a little bit at a time, okay? Oh, so good. Thanks, the drink. Oh, so good. Some over there. Okay, do some more. Here. Good job. Good job. Look at you go. Awesome. Is it all gone? Yeah, good job. And High five. Is it get watered enough? I think so for now, but remember, we got to water them more tomorrow. Why? Because <laughs> we got to water them every day. Now let's make sure we did everything right. Oh, yes, we did. Okay. We've okay. got everything done. Now We've got our seeds planted. Now We've got them watered. Now what do we do next? Now let's put the bridge on here and decorate. Yeah, you like that there? Yeah. Maybe uh, the tools can go here. Mm -hmm. We don't know how to put the bridge on those. Yeah, it goes right here. Do it like that. And look, don't forget you've got these. Okay, but where did they go? <laughs> Whatever you'd like. Inside? Maybe. Because these go inside. Inside. Where do you want to put the fairy? Well, we should put it inside, too. Well, I don't know if everything will fit inside. Why? Because it's a small, tiny space. Maybe she can sit here and keep an eye on the plants. Good job. Maybe come over here and put the rabbit somewhere for me. Maybe it should be up there too. Come over here. Maybe it should be over there too. Mm -hmm. I both of these. I love that idea. A lot of people land you there. <laughs> That's not for the funny rabbit. That right there. Good job. Oh my. He's been silly today. Yeah. And then we'll put a little bit more dirt on there just to make sure that everybody's covered up. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let me squeeze it out. Squeeze it out. Come over here. That was fun. Now what do we do next? We gotta wait and watch them grow. Say bye everyone. Bye everyone. We finished with our fairy garden and now we're making cookies. Rayla, what's your favorite kind of cookie? Uh, the green frosting and the green blue frosting. Yum, you're such a good cook. How many more are you gonna make? Okay, I gotta make all of them different kinds. Sweet. I can't wait to eat them. I love you. I love you too. Okay, guys, so to round up this week of vlogging and stuff, I'm just going to show you some of my more of my favorite pain distractions, which are blind bags, blind boxes, things of that nature. Um, so I've got four of these. They're really awesome. They're DC Super Friends. And then I have one of these boxes. That's X-Men. They're vinyl bobbleheads. So they're like little miniature bobbleheads. 
So let's get to it. Here's the first one I'm going to open. And here we have the little pullout that's going to show all the different collectibles you can get. Here's the back. want to open the wrong box. It's been that kind of week. Awesome. I got Supergirl. Pretty good detail on these things, I think. This will make some really good addition, a really good addition to my nerdy collectibles. So I got her and it comes with an accessory and this looks like a fire hydrant that she's ripped out of the ground. <laughs> Excuse my nails. They are way past getting done. Doot. Ooh, and I got a bat girl. Redhead. What, what? Let's see what her accessory is. Hmm. This looks like a very complicated weapon of some sort. Anyway, goes in there something like that. Maybe it goes this way. Hang on there. Our third one. Ooh, awesome. The green arrow. Even has his little hood. You have failed this city. And of course, he's got to have his bow and arrow. So far, no repeats. And this is Lex Luthor. Lex Luthor. Do, 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 do. And he comes with this cool thing. And so that's all of them. Let's line them all up. And now on to our X-Men blind box. These are all the different ones you can get. I don't know if I showed that earlier. So mysterious. Ooh, Storm. That is so cool. She is one of my favorites. And my cute little bobblehead. Do -do -do. Cool. There you have it. X-Men and DC. So we got some Marvel action and some DC action. Hope you guys thought this was fun. Thank you so much for joining me on this little vlogging adventure. Hopefully um, it gave you some inspiration for those days when you're not feeling so well and you don't think you can do some certain things. You've got this. If I can do it, you definitely can do it. <laughs> And um, if you want to see any more kind of vlogs or you want to see any other little aspects, little peeks into other aspects of my journey, please let me know in the comments below. Um, also check out this awesome, <laughs> this awesome headband I got. I'm trying to get more 20s inspired clothing since we are again in the roaring 20s. Got this at a store called Discovery Outlet here in Cleveland, Tennessee. Anyway, side note, rambling. Again, thank you so much for joining me. Please click a like and subscribe. It's a free way to help me out. Hope you guys are having a great day. And I will see you in the next one. Mwah!